Welcome to my channel, Meditating Human. I am Tiffany, and our focus, our mantra, our meditation, our gratitude, it's going to be decide on, decide what you want, decide on what you want, right? And so, a lot of the times, we go through our day, we go through our life, and let's just keep it to the day, we go through our day with not knowing what we want to accomplish for the day. And it's kind of the same thing, almost same thing like setting an intention, right? Because to set the intention, you have to decide on what you want. And so when you wake up, you decide on how you want your day to go. And so, and this is what I found. When I wake up in the morning, and you, or I find that if I don't state it, that my day automatically, it happens by default. You know what I mean? Like, I didn't set a particular intention. I don't know how I want my day to go. Even if I just wake up like today, it's going to be a good day. That's it. Sometimes I'll know exactly what I want to see happen today. Other times I don't and the day just unfolds the way it needs to unfold in order for that truth to be true. Today's gonna to be a good day. And thank you. Thank you, universe. Thank you, source. Thank you, primary creator. Thank you, God, that today is a good day. And I get up from my meditations and I, and I start upon my day and I swear that I start to get that feeling, I get that energy rush, like, yeah, no, I know today is gonna be a good day. Like, you feel that energy moving behind the scenes and it's just, it feels good. It's just it's all this wonderful, great, positive energy and you just feel all that energy shifting and moving uh, to the universe, moving that energy to make sure that you have a good day. And so, which is why it's important that especially in the beginning of the day. And of course you can do this throughout the day, but I find it to be most effective, especially in the beginning of the day, because when you say what you say, when you say, when you decide how you want your day to go, then it's almost like an agenda. You know what I mean? It's like an agenda for your day. Like, this is how my day is going to go. Today is going to be a good day. I am going to accomplish these three things today. And lo and behold, without even trying, you've accomplished those tasks for the day with time to spare, and you can maybe do something else. And so with that, it just helps to push you in the right direction and it helps to keep you moving in that direction you know as a, and and even if something happens during that day where you fall backwards you take a step back and you feel that ah negative energy starting to rise and creep up on you and it's like this is the antithesis of a good day of a good feeling this is not it you know, my energy is telling me that I am moving in the absolute wrong direction because having a good day doesn't feel like this. So even if something happens and you don't necessarily register, right, that uh, register that event mentally, energetically, um, Something happens, something that you would deem to be negative happens, and it's just like, oh, okay, all right, you know, whatever, and maybe you start complaining to yourself, but this hap but it happened, but you're also doing something else, which is what's taking up most of your attention. So, you know, what the thing that happens kind of playing out in the back of your mind, and all of a sudden, by the time you look, look up, you feel this energy arise, you feel like, why do I feel like this? Why do I feel, <sighs> don't feel good. This is, I'm supposed to be having a good day today. This is not what a good day feels like. S stating what you wanna see for that day keeps you in check 
for the rest of the day. It is your benchmark for the rest of the day because you know that, okay, feeling good and better, feeling good and lower. And if you're feeling good and lower, I need to at least bring it back up to here. Feeling good and better, this is where you want to be, right? I have the power. I hold my power. I know what I want. And part of holding your power and acknowledging your power, it's also by definition not abdicating your power, right? So you're not just fumbling through your day and whatever, whatever is gonna be is gonna be and whatever and I, you know, I don't have any choice over it and it's just going to happen, not true. You have all the choice over what happens in your day. So by saying, throwing your hands up, like I don't, it's just whatever's gonna happen is gonna happen. And you move on from it, you are abdicating your power. And so more often than not, you're going to get exactly what you don't want. And then a lot of us sit back and say, well, I never, you know, people say they never get what they want. They never, you know, see the, see the good or see the benefits. They never, you know, good things never happen to them. Not true. Stop and think about your mindset. Stop and think about what you're putting out there. Stop and think about what, how you have decided your day to go. And we all know, gonna state the obvious, day by day adds up to your life. You slap, it all those, you slap all those days together, it's your life. And so being that we know that, why don't we day by day decide that this is how I want my day to go? Because ultimately, it's how your life is going to go. We're just doing it in bite-sized chunks. Some people can say, this is how my life to go, this is how I want my life to go and follow that broad stroke. Other people are like, well, that's too much. We're going to whittle that down. This is how I want my day to go, you know? This is how I want the next 30 minutes to go. This is how I want the afternoon to go. You do it in, you, you keep it to a size that's manageable for you. That makes sense for you so that it doesn't overwhelm you because then if it overwhelms you, then it turns into, I can't do that. <sighs> that's too much for me. It doesn't make sense forget about it. It turns into that and that's not what we want. We want you to be able to do it in a size that makes sense for you so that you can say, today is how I want my day to go. This week is how I want this week to go. And you move forward on that path. It's almost giving you direction for how you need to move forward in your life, how you need to move forward in the world, how you interact with other people, the energy that you take in, the energy that you push out. That one or two sentence, those one or two sentences dictates how your day, and we'll keep it for a day, we keep it to days for this, for this conversation, but it dictates how your day goes. And it does it on such a subtle level that you probably don't even realize it. But it does, and it happens. And it also unfortunately happens in the other direction. So, focus. I have power. I hold my power. I know what I want. Thank you, universe, for helping me conspiring with me to get what I want. Thank you that I know who I am in this world. And until next time.
I will see you later. Bye.